Hey guys, you guys want to be a mobile welder? Uh, let me show you all the tools I have. You might need more, but I'm just going to show you what I have. I got more, but I'll just show you what, uh, you know, what you're going to need to begin with. Uh, so, I have my truck here. You can use any kind of truck. It doesn't have to be a truck like this. You know, I used to have a Ford Ranger, 1994 Ford Ranger, four cylinder, stick shift. I really love that truck and I used to have the same machine on the Ford Ranger but let me show you real quick so this is my truck it's a 2016 Ford F-150 and uh, I want to show you what I got in the back I got a Miller Bobcat 250 that thing is nice this is my second machine I've had uh, the other one, I had it for eight years, and uh, but I sold it and never gave me any problems. So this is the second machine I've had. And here, I got a, a small uh, Miller. It's a Miller Matic 141. This thing is perfect. You know, they weld rails. Uh, I mean, I've welded up to half inch. You know, you, should be, you, you shouldn't really be using using it to weld half face but it's welded perfect you know if i don't use this i always use this right here my ln 25 lincoln i'm using the 232 and i i used it on one of my videos i don't know if you guys seen it but one of my videos i welded there was seven columns i had to weld three three quarter inch fill weld multiple pass that thing ran perfect with the uh, Miller Bobcat 250. It was perfect. You know, it didn't give, any, give me any problems. We welded like for, I don't know, like eight hours and, you know, no problems. Uh, you know, you're gonna need welding hood, face shield, grinders. I just did, uh, last week I finished, uh, uh, we did some gates and some rails. I had to bring down the concrete because it was not level. So I use this grinder with this uh, concrete uh, grinding wheel. You know, plenty of uh, measuring tapes. You're gonna need plenty of lead. I just put everything down here because I'm trying to clean up my truck here. But uh, plenty, you need plenty of uh, extension cords. You know, that really helped out setting those rails. You know, the rotor hammer. This is what I have. Here I got my uh, 7018 rod that I use. We use uh, from the egg bolts. This is what we use. You know, I mean, there's plenty of tools. I got, I got a lot of tools. I need more, but you know, just use what you got. You know, but especially you need your welding generator. Small welding machine. You know, you need lots of squares. I mean, hammers, uh, bevels, uh, saw saw. This thing really helped out for uh, setting those anchor bolts. You know, just to blow off all the all the uh, the dust. This thing really helped out. This right here. This thing's a beauty for the anchor bolts. You know. Lead. Uh, I got more tools over there. This is rail I'm doing for my house here. That's gonna go maybe uh, in the kitchen and separate the living room. But uh, oh, don't let me forget. Me and my son just got that trailer. That thing's beautiful, you know. We uh, took all the rails, the gates in that tr uh, trailer. That thing's it's only uh, 16 feet long. But it was perfect for uh, what we were doing. But yeah, guys, uh, like I said, I mean, even if you just have a little machine like this, you know, just to do repairs and rails, and uh, you don't have to have a big machine like that. If you can afford it, if you can get one, nice. You know, you can do whatever you want. And yeah, guys, so if you guys want to start your uh, own uh, mobile, welding business 
Uh, I just wanted to share a little bit of what I have. You know, I got a compressor over there. I got more tools, but I just wanted to show you this is a compressor. You know, I use a uh, paint gun over there. There's more tools I have, but I just kind of wanted to show you a little bit of what I have. And uh, I wish you guys luck, you know. It's just getting started, you know. And, uh, you know, thank God I was able to get this job. It was a pretty big job. You guys are going to be able to see it on uh, one of my videos I just put up. So if this was able to help you guys a little bit, you know, just so you can see what I have, what you can buy, what you can use. And I wish you guys luck. And thanks for watching.